top five. Um, morning, guys. Welcome hey, back. Hey, squad. Hey. Squad. hey. Do all that stuff on your channel. <laughs> welcome back to my channel, guys. Um, welcome back to a vlog. As you guys know, I am with my sister. She is currently going through my Fenty products. Hey. As, we get, as we get ready to go to Makanda for the arts festival. So remember I told you guys in my previous video, which this video will come out after the previous video, that we are going for the National Arts Festival. Sponsored by Standard Bank. The very first bank I ever banked with, but then technically speaking, my dad opened up the the bank for me, and then I had money, but my dad could control that money and he could take it, and then basically it was his money that he put in my bank account. But then I remember the time that my dad was so mad at me that he took my Standard Bank card. See, parents, traumatic. Anyway, um, so what we're gonna do now is we're probably gonna have a quick chit chat. My dad is gonna take us to the airport, and we'll talk to you guys when. Oh, okay. Look, this is her at the function. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Okay, guys, so we're going to get ready, wait for my dad, and we'll talk to you guys as soon as we get to the airport. But shout out to Fenty Africa, thank you so much. And the next event, I'll be coming with okay. my sister. I didn't actually show you guys my airport fit. Mm. Yeah. Chief, that. Okay, here's our airport fits. Uh, we're wearing all black as per usual, sneakers, and yeah. Someone she's on Twitter. Got the, she's got what are these? These are the Air Force. No, these are the dunks. These are the dunks, baby. Yes, <laughs> Here's in case. Here's the life. That time I'm a little I'm a little What? Hold on. and uh, we're now getting ready to board so what I'm gonna do now is we're just gonna wrap our bags and then maybe grab something to eat and then we're gonna make our way Nanaka, not Nananga, and the pretty ladies have said we need to try pies or a rooster bread. Hi 
Alright guys, just made our first stop. We are at Nanaka Farm Stall here with my sister. We're here now and we're getting ready to meet everybody. Uh, I can't wait to meet them. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. Yes, my secret guy. Hold on. Shop, baby. Hello, hi, 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 hi. How are you? Good, thanks. I'm your lady. How are you? Hi, my Nice to meet you. Oh, hello. Ah, hello. Ah, some of you are saying piggy. The woman does not say a piggy. Yeah, that. Is it a chair? Okay, let's go, guys. We here, baby. Ah, yeah. Come through so I can give you your bag. Let's go, low. just arrived not entirely sure where we're going so we're gonna check in and see if we're at the right cornerstone manor but my sister and I are here first I'm coming, my guy. <laughs> yeah. yes I think so we just need to check if we're at the right place we cornerstone manor. manor yeah is this one constitutional hill yeah. Yeah, here. Thank you. Hello. Oh, hi. Hey guys. Um welcome back. So we are finally in our room. As soon as we got here, we needed to check in. We needed to do quite a, a lot of things. But now that we have finally settled, we got our room keys, we parked the cars. We are at a place called Cornerstone Manor. And I just want to kind of show you guys a quick room tour. It's not going to be that big because it's actually quite a small room for my sister and I. So say hi Katia. So there's my sister right there. As you can see, we've got two separate beds, which is great because I don't need her on top of me watching some ETV. And then just a quick idea of the bathroom. Well, I really like this little spot over here. I guess when Kadlo and I have our naughty corner, we'll be here. And then here's the bathroom, which I really, really like, to be really honest with you guys. I like open plan showers. Um my sister has a love-hate relationship with showers she fears athlete's foot makes all the sense in the world athlete's foot is grimy and scary yeah. and it's so uncomfortable so now that we've arrived uh we've decided that we're not going to change because we are feeling a little bit tiresome we thought we would make it in time for some acts today but judging by the time frames we still need to sit down and discuss what plays we want to attend what acts you know there's a lot to choose from and we literally only just settled in now yeah. and i think everybody just probably needs some time to rest so we're going to jump into the quick group meeting figure out where everyone is figure out what's happening yeah. and then we're going to take it from there guys so i'm going to talk to you guys as soon as we meet everybody else bye guys say bye hi but gucci gucci no yeah i don't know stop and the first thing I have to say is that driving through Grahamstown was crazy because it felt like driving through Stellenbosch actually you know when a town is embedded with a lot of culture and you can tell just from driving through the buildings and the roads 
and you know what I loved most is that well the university where Rhodes is it's like a little mini town of universities and I never got to experience that obviously because I went to a different varsity altogether but it was nice seeing students walk around casually seeing St. Andrew's school I thought St. Andrew's school was a girls school but I guess I was wrong but anyway back to the actual event we are here at the monument Kata, what is this the settlers monuments settlers monuments and we're gonna obviously take a quick tour um look at how standard bank has definitely like filled up the town like wherever you drive around you're seeing standard bank everywhere so we're really excited and we're hoping to have something exciting oh and there's also going to be like a comedy show that we're going to be doing later so looking forward to that my sister's voice is by my voice <laughs> <laughs> like I want to talk but I keep listening to you so yeah no 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 we just we, we're journalists I'm kidding we're youtubers can I can I can hi, you, can I? hi. Hello. Hi. we're from Trick the Musical I oh. made a band wait what is it called Trick the Musical oh my god I'm gonna go to Trick the Musical we're performing it here today yeah. what time at, uh, um, at the monument here um, at the bottom what time uh, we're not sure okay we're the I'm second last show are you the second last show? Yeah. You can I come watch it at the King's Theatre. You can come watch it at the um, King's Theatre okay, we'll um, tomorrow. Um, um, between okay. um, uh, no, o'clock and, 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 and four. And then on <laughs> Sunday. I'll be there. I'll be there. I'll see you guys. Okay. And remember I said, guys, on my vlog that I wanted to watch Shrek the Musical. So I guess we're watching Shrek the Musical. You know what I'm saying? Hey, Nina. I like to this part. Shrek the Musical. It's very fast, it's very brutal. You're into quite a run. Fantastic. I'm so excited for National Arts Festival. wanted to get samosas but at six o'clock on the dot they close so we're going to be watching the show called Ifu Lindao and really excited to see what's going to be happening <laughs> we're really excited to see if it's going to play out but yeah they're not going to open anymore i'm so hungry oh my god Just watched the first show called what is it called? Uu Tandolet Kailis Ikum or Ikum Lenda Ebul Lenda Ebul Lenda. Not you not knowing how to read Zulu when you understood the whole play. So we just watched Ipum Lendao, which was actually recommended by Toby. And okay, the acting was superb. I'll say that. Did I understand? Mm, yeah, no, not much. We had completely different theories of it, but more or less, 
I guess the the similarities of the themes that were displayed were similar, right? But I guess I had a hard time as someone who obviously doesn't understand Kosa. I had a hard time picking up on most of what was said, but I understood the concept through what was portrayed act-wise. So I would definitely give it an eight out of ten. I think the only two was just obviously the not understanding part that was very difficult for me. But what yo the acting was superb. The acting was superb. So now we really wanted to slot into um, to uh, plays to act. We wanted to check out a, a comedy skit, but unfortunately now we can't do that. So we're gonna go straight to dinner. And let me just say the cold is colding right now. Okay. But yeah, we're gonna do dinner, and I think we'll probably call it a night after that because we have an early morning. But so far, wow, compelling. Hey, like, like it. You literally in the moment. You literally feeling the emotions. It doesn't feel constructed with edits and you know some fake tears. Everything is as real as they make it seem. You know, and it's a lot. It's a lot to take in. Yeah, and that's my sister in the background. Okay, we're gonna go to the long table and then I'll talk to you guys tomorrow morning. day two so I would love to show you my outfit but we don't have like a mirror to show you as what I'm wearing so I'm gonna go to breakfast right now I have breakfast with everybody and then we're gonna prepare for day two of the National Arts Festival well no. good morning hi guys apparently your breakfast is the best do I sit down? Yeah. That's because yeah. we go to bed early. We're old. No. Yeah. No, 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 no. Okay, so do we go in the kitchen and say, hey, can I please have an English breakfast? No, she'll come out. She'll, she'll and then she'll out. tell you to first go there. I'm the cook was like, yeah. That's actually weird. I didn't see so, that. So I had like I a need, tiny little fruit bowl. I can't. I'm so glad at that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
here we are first stop we are going to be watching Alapi, which is a highly anticipated play we are at graham college which is where they're going to be obviously you know showcasing the play looking forward to it however i wish i could find some water because i don't really feel good my tummy is feeling weird but anyway we're gonna watch the show and i'll let you guys know we're gonna watch a series of shows today so stick around with me and let's enjoy the national arts space and what else yeah. just finished the second show Alapi. I'd be lying if I said the arts is not slowly taking over my spirit. It was such a moving piece of work about the community of the people from Inuit, which is a very small town located in the top of Canada, if I'm not mistaken. But it just talks about colonization and how so many cultures are slowly colonized and forget the essence of their culture or are forced to forget the essence of the culture and just when I thought that there was nothing that would top the first piece that we watched yesterday I don't think anything will top a lot here. so if you are around and I do release this vlog before the second weekend I urge you to watch a lot here. it was a really compelling piece it actually even made me emotional a bit and um, it was a lot to take in because there were so many like similar or parallel storylines about the community of the Inuit and colonization as well as South Africans and our cultures and how we were slowly colonized and kind of forced to forget what we believe in or how we're alienated, you know? So I don't want to say too much. My sister started in the car, so I'm going to get in. Finished with The Sun Doesn't Say Chat by Tami Majella. He was the Standard Bank Youth Award for he won. He was the winner for the Standard Bank Youth Award for 2022. So now we're gonna go see Msaki and enjoy the rest of the evening. I'm a bloggers.
watching for the day so now I think what we need to understand is that each show actually takes up so much time and takes up a lot of energy out of you but now we are here to do something else that's extremely fun and that is called the market right village yeah, the green village market yeah where the village people come mm -hmm. the market free market type of place yeah and there's food and stuff like that yeah and that sounds right. real good and anything that's got food you know I'm about it yeah. <laughs> So I, I am this, right? really excited, I eating, that. you know, just relaxing my mind because I think a lot of the arts takes out so much of you that you need to actually come down. Yes, we need to come down now. Back so now, hi Toby! Hi! I'm doing this so that you can just do the intro and tell everyone where we are. Okay, so we're where at are the we? Village Green Market. What we're going to do is we're going to get some food, some sundowners because what we've had a long day. Somebody? Okay, wow. a long day of crying, right. emotional. Toby made us cry, yeah. but it's fine. We forgive him. Yeah. So now right. we're just going to settle in and try new foods and drinks. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Here's the crew. Here's the crew. Hi! Hey y'all! Hi y'all! I'm Terry Swamp. Hi y'all! Yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay guys. Uh, 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 Girl, no, I'm not dead tired when it comes to food. Oh my god, this chip and dip, I'm gonna oh, die. Okay, so let's do a food taste test, okay? <laughs> Starting off day three and the last day of being at the Grahamstown Festival. Now I'm extremely tired because we went out last night, went back to Long Table to get some food. But anyway, I'm basically hungry and I'm a walking corpse right now. But we are getting ready to do a couple of like, you know, background stuff for Standard Bank. And then I think after that, my trip with my sister will have come to an end and then we will be driving back to the airport. Our flight is only at three this afternoon. So what we want to do is um, after we do the work that I'm meant to do, we want to go check out this place called Jack's Bagels. Yeah. Maybe have some breakfast there. It looked like a really cute quaint coffee shop slash yeah. breakfast spot. So it'll give us some time to try one more good restaurant before we call it a day. Yesterday we wanted to go to Major Fraser, Major Fraser's, but it is an outdoor place and it was full, full, full. I think it is a popular spot to go to in Grahamstown, so we didn't get a chance to try that. However, I am looking forward to trying Jack's Bagels. Um, it really looks nice. I saw a couple of kids coming out of there, so it looks like a cute little family spot. And then I think our vlog will have come to a complete end. Anyway, let's go hang out with the team, get some work done, and then go get some bagels. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Not this catch. Uh. Yes, no, it's spooky. 